wage slavery, corporate slavery. You know, that's all I see around here. That's all I see in society. That's all I see in America. That's all I see in pretty much every country, every civilization in the world today, you know? Corporate slavery. You know, you start off as a kid, you know, you're innocent, haven't been corrupted by the world yet. They tell you, you can be anything that you want to be. You can be a superhero. You can be an actor. You can be a, a basketball player, a football player. You can be a rock star. You can be a rapper. You can be an astronaut. You can be anything that you want to be. Then when it's, you know, when, when a kid grows up, when they, they get about, you know, 18, you know, that they late adolescence boom they smack the sad fucking just reality just hits them right in the fucking face they slap them with this this sad miserable reality of remember all that shit that I told you as a kid that you can be anything that you want to be uh it was all bullshit it was all just a fucking lie you know what you're actually gonna do you're gonna be a slave to the government that's what you're going to be. You're going to be a slave to the fucking government. You know why? Because I'm a slave to the government. You know why? Because I'm too pussy to stand up to the government. You know why? Every Everybody else is too pussy to stand against the government. You know why? Because we're all fucking pussies. That, that's, that's what it is, right? So, you know, you're in school. You're in this unnatural fucking... This unnatural environment. Sitting in a desk... Within sitting for long periods of time is unhealthy for the human body because we're made to run around and, you know, be active and be creative because that's how we evolved, you know, and all this school stuff and this society civilization is actually new to humans because anatomically we're the same as we were 200,000 years ago, right? So we're in this unnatural environment in school and we're not learning anything. You know, all it teaches is how to be an obedient drone, you know, regurgitation, you know, mot mot um, rote memorization, regurgitation of false information. Because the stuff that they're telling us, all it is is American propaganda. Of course, they're going to tell you that America went won every war. Of course, they're going to tell you that America is the best country, the greatest country in the world. Of course, they're going to tell you that. You know why? They're fucking America. They want you to be a blind idiot, a blind drone, a blind fan to their destruction, to everything that they do. You know, they want you to say the Pledge of Allegiance. How do you have a five-year-old kid saying the Pledge of Allegiance? They don't even know what the fuck they're pledging their allegiance to. Right? So they they raise you up as this obedient drone that doesn't question authority, that doesn't question anything, that looks for the, the confirmation and the acceptance and the approval of authority, which doesn't actually exist. And so they grow up thinking that they need to answer to someone. They grow up thinking that they need to, you know obey somebody take orders from someone so they grow up craving the need to be somebody's lackey to be another man's slave so now they go to college where they accumulate debt and pretty much learn the same things as they learned in school how to be a lackey a corporate lackey because that's all you are how to take orders from another man if another man tell you do this work Work that machine, do that paperwork, haul that wood. They teach you how to do it, how to take orders and do it. They're not teaching you how to be innovative. They're not teaching you how to be creative. They're not teaching you how to critically think. They're not teaching you how to be a logical thinker, a rational thinker, you know, how to be self-sufficient. They're not teaching you any of that. You know why? They don't want you to be a critical thinker because critical thinkers oppose their status quo. They want you dependent on their system. So where they can control, they can control however you live. You know what? They want, they want to maintain their power. That's their only interest. They don't give a fuck about you. They don't give a fuck about your family. They don't give a fuck about any of that shit. 
right? They, they want to control you. They want to control you. They want to rule you. And they want to keep their power. That's the only thing that they care about. So now you're in college and you're thousands of dollars in debt doing something that you don't even want to do just because your parents told you to do it. And, and when in reality, your parents are just brainwashed drones because they're just victims of the same brainwashing as any other person. It doesn't change just because they're your parents. It's not special just because it's your parents, just because it's your particular parents. It's not just that doesn't mean anything. Just because they're your parents doesn't mean they know everything. They can be idiots just like any other common idiot. It's like you call that random person an, a jackass or an idiot. That can be your parents. And they, you're just listening to their advice blindly without questioning them. You're not even going to you know, put up any fight, no rebuttal. You're not even going to refute what they have to say. Because you think that obedience is an, a concept that should be followed, that should be used. Obedience is bullshit. Obedience... Is a bullshit notion it shouldn't be used in any aspect at any context at all it's bullshit you shouldn't obey anything you know who obeys a fucking dog a dog that we selectively bred to obey us that is what obeys you know what obeys a fucking slave people that were forcibly fucking people that were forced to do what another man says and if they didn't they were beaten and killed and hanged that's what that's who obeys a dog a, a a damn animal that we've selectively bred for the sole purpose of obeying us that's who obeys but they want you as a human being to obey another human being that eats like you shits like you breathes like you bleeds like you pisses like you they want you to obey that person as if they're inherently better than you as a man so now you get out of college you're in fucking massive amounts of debt you, you know what you got your little degree your little piece of paper that means jack shit it means fuck all it means nothing but they got you they brainwashed you to think that a degree means that you're intelligent but it doesn't because a degree and a diploma doesn't measure intelligence it measure it measures obedience right you're not autodetactic because you don't have any individual thought. You don't even know how to critically think for yourself. So any thoughts that you people have is not even an individual thought. It's nothing but the prescribed, the prescribed consensus that the government and the powers that be, the powers that be, I say that in air quotes because it's not actually powers, but you know what I mean? They want these people that are controlling the media, you know, the capitalistic elites, they, their agenda is what they popularized, is what they push on everybody else. And since humans have the predisposition to, to be sheep and follow people, be followers, they're going to accept that as the right way to do something. That's why you think what you think if you're an average person. Even though the average person don't even know, they, they think that they're not the average person, but they are. So you, so the average person that you know, you go around thinking that I have this piece of paper that means I'm smarter than you. When that you don't even know that just by saying that you're, you're acknowledging that a standardized test which doesn't measure intelligence that was arbitrarily created by another man is the standard, is the the pinnacle, is the the plateau that we aim for, that we're supposed to aim for as human beings. You know, so another man's arbitrary, arbitrary, you know, judgment of intelligence or worth as a human being. And so, you know, now you have to, you have your degree. You can't even get a job in the, the field that you want. So you know what you're doing now? You're working a miserable ass, suck ass job. Why did you go to college? To get a high paying job because, you know what? Capitalism teaches us. And tells us that it doesn't matter if you're a good person. It doesn't matter if you're compassionate, altruistic. No, that doesn't fucking matter. You know what matters? Having paper. Having worthless fucking paper. It doesn't matter how you get it. it doesn't matter if you kill for it. Fucking rape for it. Kidnap people for it. it doesn't fucking matter. Because if you got money, you're worth. You're better than everybody that has less money than you. That's what capitalism teaches us. 
right? Doesn't matter if you're happy, doesn't matter if you're, you know, suffering from depression, doesn't matter if you're suicidal, doesn't fucking matter. Because it's all about the money, right? Okay. So you go to college for the high paying job because your parents told you to do to, so you can have money, right? And so now you're working a shitty job, you're not even getting the money. So now you're a slave, you, you tell her, you're making another man rich with your labor and the man doesn't even know your name. But you're working every day kissing his ass just and to make him rich. To get this little scraps of money just to survive and do the same thing again. And you're miserable, you wanna commit suicide. But why do you do it? Well, it gets the bills paid. That's fucking stupid. Gets the bills paid. So you'd rather do something that you fucking hate to get just enough to survive and keep doing something that you hate? That's fucking stupid. I'd rather just fucking commit suicide. I'd rather not live. It's not a, that's not a quality of life. That's bullshit. That's all they think of you. From the moment that you're born, it doesn't matter... You know, oh, they don't look at you like, oh, this little cute little baby, that could be anything. He can be an entrepreneur. He can be a fucking uh, great musician, a great artist, a creator, an inventor, an innovator. Nope, they look at you. That's going to be my corporate lackey. They're going to be my goddamn lackey. I'm going to scream at him. I'm going to demean him as a human being. And he's going to do what the fuck I say, and he's going to get whatever the fuck I give him. You know why? Because I'm better than him. Because this is my system. This is my gang that I fucking created. That I'm winning, I'm winning and I'm the captain of it. You know why? Because I fucking created this shit and I, I'm going to oppress all of you motherfuckers and I'm going to make the game to where you have to do what the fuck I say just to survive. Yeah, that's right. That's what, the, that's what capitalism is. All this shit was founded off of fucking rape, war, genocide, slavery. But they try to put sweep that shit under the rug like it never happened. So And then they make rules and laws to where you can't do the same thing that they did to get their power. Right? So now you're fucked. So now you're fucked. Right? So. So that's all they think about you. A lackey. That's what they think about you. Nope. They don't, they don't think about you on an individual level. They don't care about your talents. They don't care about your ambitions. Nope. A lackey. A damn work stiff, a work drone, a work slave. You're just in a fucking, on a damn treadmill, man. You're not going anywhere. You think that you're going somewhere. They sell you that dream. They sell, that, they sell you that illusion, right? That if you work hard enough, if you work for me, if you work for us, hard enough, you, you, you might just be successful. You know why? Because hard work equals success. That's bullshit. If hard work equals success, then why the fuck are there millions of people that work pretty much their whole entire fucking lives? They're poor and they don't have shit to show for it. Because that's bullshit. They just sell you that just so you can be a happy work slave. That's all bullshit. It's all fucking bullshit. They sell you that fucking illusion. You know? So you can be a happy work slave. They want you to be miserable. You're running on a fucking treadmill. You think you're going somewhere. You're not going no fucking where. Because you know why? You're scared to buck the system, man. They don't want you to buck the system. They don't want you to actually find ways to live your life. They don't want you to actually find out that, man, all this societal bullshit is bullshit. That, my, that society is bullshit. The laws are bullshit. The rules are bullshit. This whole system, this game is bullshit. That's all it is, man. Corporate slavery, wage slavery. So now you work your entire fucking life. You spend your whole damn, your only life working. For what? Just to barely fucking survive and put fucking tiny fucking morsels of food in my mouth just to have just enough energy to wake up and do the same fucking thing again until I fucking die? Wake up, go to work, pay bills, repeat, die.
You're miserable throughout the whole fucking process. You know why? Because you don't want to fucking do that bullshit. You just do it for a fucking check. The check you get ain't shit anyway. You ain't fucking... How you gonna save to, to make up your life better? How you gonna save you don't have nothing? You, how, it, you gotta have some shit to save, but they don't... They do this shit specifically and intentionally. You think this shit is haphazard. Look at... look. Just look around in the world. Look how things are. You think this shit is just haphazard? No, this shit is specifically and intentionally designed this fucking way. You know why? Because it maintains their fucking power. They don't actually give a fuck if you're a criminal. They don't give a fuck. A crim you know what criminal means? Criminal means against them. That's all it means. It doesn't mean bad. It doesn't mean morally bad. It doesn't mean... No. Bullshit. Criminal means against the government. Against the ruling class. That's what the fuck it means. The rich get richer. The poor stay poor. The poor get poor. That's what the fuck it is. Right? They don't want individual critical thinkers. They don't want people that's gonna buck the system, say fuck the system. And they want slaves. Slaves, man. Corporate fucking slaves. 